Hi, my name is Glenda and I work as a record analyst at Spring Hill Medical Center. I, part of my responsibilities is analyzing the record and identifying any necessary deficiencies. I also work closely with doctor's offices and their PAs and making sure that they, we apply the correct deficiencies. For example, if I'm looking through a record, the patient's record, I will look through it and make sure that the doctor has signed. If the doctor did not sign, then I would ask the doctor to sign. Then the other deficiencies that I would load would be to dictate. If the patient came here and had an operation, then I would ask the doctor to dictate, to pick up a phone and dictate that operation so it can go to that individual record. It is my job to make sure that that individual record is perfect. My normal uh, week would be 40 hours and it's Monday through Friday. And I would say my stress level, it varies, but overall I would say it's low, it's very low. Part of the qualifications for this position, it's a high school diploma with medical records experience. But in that, you will have to have a little bit of uh, public speaking. You would have to communicate with the doctors, with the physicians, their offices, other hospitals. And it will be great with grammar because you will have to write a little bit. It won't be lengthy but you will have to communicate with the physicians via written or public speaking. Uh, the best part of my job is that it's electronic. This way, since it is in the computer, I don't have to deal with many papers all day long like they used to do before. Uh, the other part that I like is that uh, we get to cross train. So while we're here, we get to learn other positions some that you could decide if you like within the department that you can grow. The worst part of my job is really the only times that we have to contact a doctor for a deficiency that they have not completed. Then it would be a little uh, hard because they would have to, they're not happy to hear from us. So that's the only part that I would see that it's a little difficult, but the rest I think it's, it's great. If you're interested in working in the health information field, this is a great job to start without a degree. This position will allow you to get your feet in the door and see if you like the health information field. And if you do uh, like it, then you can move up in positions here and it allows you to go back to, the, to college and get a degree.